Today, I want to showcase a recent enhancement we've made to Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Database Service. Database Service on Virtual Machines. Over the past year, we've seen many enterprise customers move their database workloads from on-prem to dedicated bare metal servers on Oracle's modern cloud infrastructure. But not all workloads need dedicated servers. Customers have asked us for a more cost-effective, easy to get started, and durable database option, well-suited for a variety of workloads, from proof of concept to dev test environments and production applications. And to accommodate these workloads, we are now enabling full-featured Oracle databases on virtual machines. Database service on virtual machines adds to the current portfolio of other database service offerings, such as database service on bare metal servers like HiIO, Dense.io, Two-Node Rack, and Exadata Cloud Service. Database service on virtual machines is built on the same high-performance, secure, highly durable, and available infrastructure used by all Oracle cloud infrastructure services. Database service on virtual machines is cost-effective and flexible. You can start as low as single OCPU and go up to 16 OCPUs. You only pay for OCPUs and storage used. You can use Oracle's flexible subscription plan with pay-as-you-go, monthly universal credits. It's very easy to get started. You can create Oracle-certified, full-featured, fully-supported 11G, 12C, both 12.1 and 12.2 databases with choice of any database edition. Native two-node rack configuration is also supported. With full root SSS access, you can use Oracle standard tools to manage your databases. Database service on virtual machines has built-in high availability constructs. You can now deploy two-node rack configurations with any virtual machine shapes. For example, you can use two-node rack configuration with two core virtual machines and a shared block storage of up to 40 terabytes. Database service on virtual machines provides a durable and scalable storage. You can use remote storage starting 256 gigabytes up to 40 terabytes. Database service on virtual machines is secure. You get all the advantages of our identity and access management for control and VCN security list to secure your database environments. Let me now show you how to create a database on virtual machine. Go to the console and click on database. Click on launch DB system. Let's type in a display name. Pick an availability domain, let's pick AD1. Select the virtual machine shape, let's select one with one OCPU. Choose a software edition, let's choose enterprise edition. Select a storage size, let's pick 256 gigabytes. We paste in the SSH key. Select a VCN network, let's choose VCN1, select a subnet, give a hostname prefix, select a database name. We can also select a database version, let's select 12.1, give a PDB name, choose a database admin password. OLTP database, let's keep that and click on launch DB system. You we'll see that the database is being provisioned and now the database is available. We have all these options. Let's click on view the DB system details. We see that the database has been provisioned with available data storage space the port numbers, the VCN details, with the shape which we have selected, the VM standard one. 
we can also scale the storage up. We can select the storage from 256 gigabytes to 512 and we can scale it up and you click on terminate to terminate the database which we have created. There, I just showed you how easy it is to create an Oracle database on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure on Virtual Machine using the console. You could also use the API or command line. For more details on database service on virtual machines, check out the resources below.